Oh god, what have they done to slides? Can I get my cursor? I don't like this. Oh, turn on laser pointer. There we go. Hey guys, Magnus Rabbit here, bringing you another video. So this is what you voted for. You voted for a character spotlight event, and that well, character spotlight. I used a little beer emoji, so I don't know if you guessed it. It of course was Barney. So we're doing a character spotlight event on Barney. So this will be interesting. Um. Bit of a harder one. I, I focused on a few different characters. I decided to try Barney because he's got some family out there. You know, he's got some girlfriends that he's had in the past. And also some potential costumes that I threw in there too. So I tried to construct an event based around Barney as a character. And I think actually this is such a good foundation for an event. I think the Van Houten event was very strong. And I've really enjoyed that event. And I think partly based due on the fact that it was quite you know focus more on millhouse and his family so i think focusing on barney is a bit unusual but i, I think it can work so I'll, I'll show you how so the mayor commences a new award springfield's greatest citizen however quimby decides to draw the name out of a big hat everyone is hoping it's them but the citizen who wins is barney so you make quimby give an award make barney collect the award if you're knocked Quimby asks Barney to talk a little bit about his life, and, you know, he, he begins to talk, and, that, and that's when you unlock the event, and if you don't already have it, you get given for free Barney with Barney's Ballerama, a completely free uh, character and building combo. Now, they could just throw this in the prize track, that's potential too, and obviously get rid of a prize, but I don't see the issue of just adding it at the start of the event for players who don't have it. I think this is such a, it's been so long in the game that this has been, you know, ever since Christmas 2012, I don't see the problem of giving this out for free. I mean, it sucks if someone like just bought him the event before, but uh, I don't know. And then also these will be the act currency. So you've got Uncle Sam posters, Duff beer, bowling balls, and coffee cups. There'll be a Gills deal. Gill will come and he'll be like, I've got a deal for you. Phillips with the Springfield Women's Prison for 200 donuts. So Phillips is a decent enough character, I guess. A pretty funny, wacky, crazy woman uh, who, of course, is a prisoner. She's a con. She killed her husband with a screwdriver, I think. Phillips screwdriver. That's what they call her Phillips. So, yeah, be cool to get her in the game. And you get this. They get the prison as well. It's always cool to have another prison. And then Act 1 will drop. In the store, you'll get the German castle with Arnold Gumbel for 150 donuts. So it's just pretty much just a castle. Uh, nothing too... It could be on fire a little bit as well. I, I'm, I'm cool with that. And you get Arnold Gumbel as a full playable character for 150 donuts. And of course, that's Barney's dad. So... Barney starts by telling the town about his family, his father a man of the army, his mother a woman of the navy. He tells the town that he always wanted to be as brave as his parents, but sadly never lived up to what they were. Barney then changes, has a change of heart and saying, do you know what, this award has inspired me to be like them. I'm joining the navy. So you make Barney join the navy, make Marge tell Homer to talk some sense into Barney, make Homer talk sense into Barney, and make Springfielders earn Uncle Sam posters, and then you're this, you will unlock the naval reserve. Which is here, little little office you get there. Barney tells Homer that he won't quit the army as long as he's uh, sorry, that he will quit the army as long as he signs this contract. Homer signs it, but Barney tricked him into rec in, it's a recruitment form. Homer and Barney are both signed up for the God. That's meant to be Navy, not Army. Skinner is filling in for the officer. Uh, by training the troops, so you make Skinner train the Navy Reserve, make Homer train, make Barney train, make Springfield own Uncle Sam posters, and this will unlock the Navy graduation stage, as you can see here. I'm sure you can have a few little NPCs sitting on it too if you want, that'd be cool. Or you could have like a crowd in front of it as well, I guess, of graduated Navy Naval Reserves, I'd be fine with that. Skinner passes both Homer and Barney, despite Homer not trying. Skinner tells them that the standards have dropped since they last tried. The Navy. Barney and Homer head out on the sub, but are quickly attacked by a vessel. You make Homer fire torpedoes, make Barney steer the sub, make Springfield his own Uncle Sam posters, and this will unlock the submarine. So this will just be sitting in the water. It'll be a, a water decoration. That'll be that'll be pretty much it. The vessel appears to just be the sea captain, thinking the sub was a whale. Homer and Barney manage to sink his ship, and now he's suing. So you make Homer file a report, make Barney file a report, make Springfielders earn Uncle Sam posters, and this will unlock the Springfield Navy base, as you can see here. 
Just want to add that this probably should be added on the waterfront because you can see the water here, so that could be pretty cool. Uh, Barney's mother tells the men that their actions were reckless and thus they are being discharged from the Navy. Barney tells his mother he was just trying to make her and dad proud, but Barney's mother says that she's always been proud of Barney, despite what he does. So you make Homer be discharged, make Barney be discharged, make Springfielders earn Uncle Sam posters, and this will unlock Mrs. Gumballs, a full playable character. Very cool. Moving on. Act 2 jumps. Love Gumbly. Immigration and Naturalization Service with... Kako? Is it, is it Keiko? Kako? Kako? I think it's Kako. Kako? I don't know. Maybe I'm saying that wrong. It's funny because you can see Marnie right here on the protester. So, she was actually seen inside the... Like, very briefly, you can see, like, her hair and her, like, and her sort of black attire. She's actually doing a test alongside, like, Luigi and Arpu and all that. So, she was seen inside this building. That's mainly the reason why I've put up with this. So, Mrs. Gumbel tells Barney that as much as she's proud of him, she would like a grandkid to leave all of her Navy pension to. Barney asks, what about her? And she tells Barney that she's been dead for years. Oh yeah, make Barney look for a woman, make Homer help Barney find a date, make Springfielders earn Duff Beer, and this will unlock the Duff Billboard, you can see here. Duff Beer, you want it. You, sorry, you know you want it. Uh, Homer has to pull Barney away from the billboard, he seems to think it's a real woman on it. Barney tells Homer... It's no use, as he he will always, he's always going to be single. Beer is his only friend, and the Bury is having a tour. So you make Barney try to get beer, make Homer try to pull back Barney, make Springfielders earn Duff beer. This will unlock the Duff machines, so you can see here. Uh, they've been proposed so many times, but the Duff, Duff Light, Duff Dry, it'd be cool to get these in the game for sure. Homer tells Barney he's signed him off one of those dating apps, and he's got a match, and, it, and, it's, and uh, they appear to be coming around in an hour. Barney has to tidy up the mess. Homer asks Marge to help, so you make Marge clean up Barney's apartment, make Homer give Barney advice, make Barney freshen up, and make Springfielders earn Duff beer. This will not Barney's apartment now. So, right, Barney's apartment, man, it's so annoying because we've never seen it. So I scoured through every appearance. It's never been seen, as far as I'm concerned, unless I miss something. The closest we have, the closest we have, is it looking like this. So most of the appearances of Barney's apartment, we only see the interior, apart from this one time where we see the, the outside of the door. So they are going to have to make this tap out exclusive, I realise that, but we can we can guess a lot of things just from like the look of this, right? So he lives in apartment 5, we know that. Uh, we can only make it, we can make it so there's only like 5 apartments here, 3 on the bottom, 2 on the top, this horrible disgusting ba banister with the socks and the dead plants, and look at the building, it's all deteriorated, the bars are like bent here. It, Yes, it will be tapped out exclusive, but it, I don't think it'll be that bad. I think they can they can easily make it just from this. Moving on. The date is Phillips. She asks Barney about his job in the nuclear plant and asks if she can ride in his sports car. Barney asks Homer on the phone if he embe embezzled stuff about him, and Homer tells him that, yeah, he did. So you make Barney sneak away from his date, make Homer delete Barney's profile, make Springfield as earned off beer, and this will unlock Barney's car. So, yeah, it's just a simple car with a mattress. I, I, I think, hell, to the hell of it, have the mattress on the top as well, be cool. So, yeah. Barney, alone and drunk, tells Mo that he'll never get... Well, not alone. Uh, Barney, with with Mo and drunk, tells Mo that he'll never get a date. Mo says, that's a shame. Mo tells Barney that there's a... there's a She's got a date. Well, not quite yet, but she's in the woman's toilets. Daria walks out. Barney? Daria? And Mo's like, you know each other? Barney and Daria talk, deciding to go on a date. So you make Barney go on a date, make Mo get mad, make Springfielders... So... Uh, earn... Duff beer, and this will unlock Daria. I know there's a lot of love for Daria. So, of course, Daria appeared in the very, 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 very first episode of The Simpsons, the uh, Simpsons roasting on, uh, roasting on an open fire. She appeared with Barney in the car uh, in the little dog racing scene, and he drives off with a presumably like a hookup, I guess, or maybe just a date. I'm not sure. But she does reappear in a later episode where she's seen holding hands with Barney, so maybe a date? I don't know. She was kind of dropped. I think they probably... Barney was still in his early stages as a character, so I think they were trying to like establish who he was. I don't think they really were at the, oh, he's a, he's a kind of worthless drunk character arc for him. So that's why I think they threw in Daria. But I still think there's a chance that we could get Daria. I don't see why not, so, so yeah. And then... 
Act 3, The Fate of the Gumbles. So you get Bowling at the Lanes with Al Gumble for 150 donuts. This is, of course, Barney's uncle and the guy who owns the Bolarama. So it's not actually Barney who owns it. He, I guess his uncle named it after his nephew. So, yeah, Al Gumble. I wanted him in the game for quite a while. I honestly was very annoyed that they didn't, they, they didn't give us him with the Pin Pals. They, they gave us Jock, which is kind of cool, but I really wanted Al Gumble. So, The Fate of the Gumbles. Barney and Daria go on a date. To Professor Frink's lecture on time travel, he asks for a subject to see their future, and Barney agrees to be the subject. Frink says that they will see Barney 30 years in the future. So you make Barney see himself in the future, make Daria see Barney's future, make Springfield his own bowling balls, and this will unlock future Moe's. So I know it doesn't look particularly different to regular Moe's. you got the S kind of slanted, the disgusting, horrible... Um, deteriorate thing you know this is like chipped away all the paint and all that so i think they can make something out of it i know it's not it won't be particularly unique i get that whether or not there should be a building i mean if we're going to be consistent it should be a separate building and not a building skin i won't be too mad if it's a building skin but i guess if you want to be consistent it has to be a building an actual building so yeah Barney is disgusted by how he's not going to be, uh, sorry, he's not going to be able to reserve his life and will always be a drunk. Daria tells him he can still change, but you make Barney reflect on his embarrassing moments, make Daria try to comfort, comfort this meant to be comfort Barney, and make Springfield his own bowling balls, and this will unlock Barney Marge, as you can see here. Funny, funny ass moment in the show for sure, so I think it would be great to, to have a costume with, uh, drunk Barney in Marge's clothes. Barney tells Daria that he's sorry and he doesn't see the point of trying as he's always going to be a drunk and he breaks up with her. Oh my god, sorry. I wrote this like so late. That's why. <laughs> There's so many spell mistakes in it. Barney goes out looking for some booze, finding the wise guy driving a duff truck. Make Barney steal the truck, make Barney drink the beer, make Springfield his own bowling balls and this one like duff, the duff truck, which will be pretty cool. It's a pretty cool looking truck with the duff and the truck. Now, I will admit, this next part of the questline is pretty depressing, but it reflects my anger of how they changed Barney into... They gave, like, Barney such a cool character arc where he became, like, a coffee addict, right? And he was no longer a drunk. And then they just reverted it. They just wanted to eat it, and now he's just a drunk forever. So, this this depressing story arc is is mainly my fr frustration of what they did to Barney. So, Barney speaks to Mo. He asks if he's alright. Barney says no. There is a warrant for his arrest, and he's found out he's spending his whole life in this dump. Mo gets mad at him, saying that he'll always, uh, it won't always be a dump. Frank tells Barney he won't always be in Mo's. So you make Barney have hope, make Barney have have his hope shot down, make Mo learn he'll lose his best customer, make Springfielders earn bowling balls in this one lock. Nelson's Crab Shack. Basically, there'll be a moment where Frank is like, yeah, yeah, you won't be at Mo's. You'll be at Nelson's Crab Shack instead. You'll be drinking there. And Barney's like, oh, God. Uh, and then Barney asks Frank if he'll really always be a drunk. Frank tells him that in this current timeline, yes, but he can change. He can't, sorry. But, but it can change if he makes changes. So make Barney make changes, make Mo kick out Frank and Barney, make Springfielders earn bowling balls, and this will unlock future Barney. Man, this wasn't as depressing as I imagined it. Oh well. But the whole breaking up with Daria stuff, that was pretty <laughs> that's pretty sad. So you get future Barney as a full playable character. Not the most interesting of future characters, I admit, but I was trying to do a spotlight event on Barney and this made sense alright so sue me. Act 4 comes along a brighter Gumball future so you get Diaper Barney with Lullaby for 150 donuts. Uh, I think this is a cool enough, a decent enough costume I think it could be pretty funny and you get the Lullaby which is a, it looks cool enough, it's a cool enough building so Barney tells Homer that he's ready to change his life for good get sober, get Daria back and put his life back on track. First thing first he's got to get Daria back. So Homer asks how Barney's going to do that and he says the old fashioned way so you make Barney apply for his helicopter license make Homer root for Barney, make Springfield his own coffee cups and this will unlock the Springfield flight school so you get this little cool building here. You can have like a, a helicopter, maybe a plane and stuff outside of it. Obviously not Barney's helicopter, I want that to be a separate item but you can have some few things there uh, now Barney has his license, him and Homer get in the chopper, make Barney fly around town looking for Daria, make Homer look for Daria, make Springfield his own coffee cups, this will unlock Barney's helicopter, as you can see here, pretty cool, this will be so a little bit like the ice car, so there will be a task with Barney in it, so you will obviously you keep it, keep it on the 
on the ground, but when it's when it's in use, it kind of disappears. But you can't like you can move it, but you can't like store it. Uh, Barney finds Daria and begs her to take him back, telling him that he's not he's gonna sorry telling her that he's gonna change his life. She agrees to give him another chance. Mo offers Barney a free beer, so you make Barney throw away the beer, make Mo be disappointed, make Homer get change for the coffee machine and make Springfielders earn coffee cups. This will unlock. The warm coffee machine, as you can see here. It was in Bart's warehouse that he buys, but I thought, why not throw it in there? It'd be cool enough for the machine to get. Uh, Barney tells Homer that now he's sober, he's got a job at Lullaby, and he has Daria, and now all he needs is a new hangout zone. So you make Homer look for a place, make Barney look for a place, make Daria look for a place, and make Springfield his own coffee cups. This will unlock Springfield's best and Seattle's worst coffee shop, or coffee it's a cool little building here, a little uh, Starbucks. Is it? St I don't even know what it's a parody of. Barney now sober with a job with Daria with a new hangout sound. Finally, can be proud of the award he has. See, so make Barney be proud, make Homer be proud of his friend, make Daria be proud of her boyfriend, and make Mo be somewhat proud of Barney. And make Springfield his own coffee cups. And finally, you unlock sober Barney as a character, as a costume. Sorry for Barney. Now I know this is not particularly the most interesting of. Costumes. I know technically we actually have a uh, task for regular Barney, which is like sober up, and he's like in a suit. I realized that I mainly wanted the sober Barney, so we could have a pretty awesome ass uh, helicopter animation. So the next award is up, and the winner is Homer. Marge and Barney tell Homer that he should take Barney as an example and try to change his life. Make Barney encourage Homer. Make Mar Homer hide away from the challenge. Make Marge be disappointed in Homer, and that's the end of the event. Moving on. So we have some tasks uh, and some animations. So for Phillips, we have sharpen a screwdriver 60 minutes. It'll be a little animation of her just doing that. Work on the prison cafeteria. Work in the prison cafeteria for four hours. That'll be the prison. Go on a date with Barney for six hours. That will be with Barney in his apartment. If you don't own his apartment, in the brown house. Answer questions about her ex-husband for eight hours. That'll be the police station. Lift weights for 12 hours. That'll be her lifting some weights. And then serve time for 24 hours. That'll be in the women's prison. For... Arnold Gumble, we have fire his rifle for 60 minutes, that'll be him firing his rifle. Storm the castle for 4 hours, I'll be in the castle. Avoid battles for 6 hours, that could be in the brown house. Admire the paintings for 8 hours, that'll be in the castle. Try unjam his rifle for 12 hours, it'll be a little animation of him trying to unjam his rifle. And then defend the castle for 24 hours, that'll be in the castle. For Mrs. Gumble, we have wake up Barney for 60 minutes, this will be an animation with Barney of her poking him with a mop. Fire slackers for four hours, that'll be the armor base. Plan a battle for eight hours, that'll be in the sub. Command the submarine for 12 hours, that'll be her on top of the sub, just kind of pointing in different directions. And then train tr troops for 24 hours, that will be at the army base. For Kak, is it Keiko? Kiko? I don't know, I'm so sorry. Do an immigration test for 60 minutes, that'll be her on a desk, you know. Writing away. Write a new song for four hours. That will be Moe's, or I guess Moe's at the Brown House. Shop for Black for six hours. That could be at any store, really. I guess, um, is there a clove store in the game? I'm trying to think. A clove store, if there's a clove store. Uh, listen to a mixtape for eight hours. That'll be the Brown House. Record a new mixtape for 12 hours. That'll be her with a little sort of makeshift kind of studio that just appears in the street and she's just making sounds into a mixtape. And then find a new artist to latch on to for 24 hours. That could be anywhere, really. For Daria, we have Date with Barney for 60 minutes. It'll be him, her, and Barney holding hands, walking around Springfield. Because I think that's cute. Bet on dogs for four hours. That'll be at the uh, Springfield Downs. Drink at Moe's for eight hours. That'll be at Moe's. Bowler, bowl bowling balls for 12 hours. That'll be her. Bowling bowling balls. Very exclusive, I know, but why not? Fly around Springfield with Barney for 24 hours. That'll be him, uh, her and Barney in the helicopter, but not animated. For Al, we have F. Freshen bowling shoes will be him with an air freshening can just spraying the bowling shoes. Uh, sabotage the competition, that will be the bowling at the lanes. Drink on the job for six hours, that will be the Bolarama. Defend against an attack from the competition, that will be the Bolarama. Clean bowling balls for 12 hours, that will be him spitting on the bowling balls with a little cloth and wipe and, and like sort of wiping them. I know, disgusting, but maybe I'm just making assumptions, but I feel like he's a disgusting guy. Is that in the show? I don't even know. Uh, run the bowler arm for 24 hours. That'll be at the bowler armor. For the costume for Bar the Barney Marge, put on makeup for 60 minutes. It'll be him, kind of putting on lipstick and 
going all over his face and then him wiping his face and doing it again. Try fix Marge's necklace for four hours. That'll be the Simpsons house. Run away from Marge. That'll be in eight for eight hours. That could be anywhere really. Fall over and be a fool for twelve hours. That'll be an animation of Barney kind of strutting along the street and then just falling over, and then sober up for twenty four hours. That'll be the Simpsons house. For future Barney, we have drinking VR for sixty minutes. It'll be him with a VR headset on. Trying to drink his beer and then like spilling it all over the machine. Maybe it like it begins to spark and stuff, and then he takes off the VR headset and then it repeats. Accept life of drinking for four hours. That could be at Moe's or the Crab Shack. Spend time in future Moe's for eight hours. That'll be the future Moe's. Throw bottles in frustration for twelve hours. That'll be him sat in a chair, kind of throwing bottles and other stuff. And find a new bar for twenty-four hours. That'll be at the Crab Shack. For the diaper Barney, we have handout flyers for 60 minutes. Little NPCs passing by and him just giving flyers. Try sell diapers for four hours. That'll be a lullabies. Go on a long, long lunch break at Moe's for six hours. That'll be at Moe's. Run the store for eight hours. That'll be at the lullaby. Chase after a di after diaper for 12 hours. That'll be him chasing after his diaper. A little bit like Baby Jesus, this one, but less creepy because this one's a man and not a baby. And quit, his quit the job for... 24 hours, again, a lullabies. And then for finally, for Sober Barney, we have drink coffee for 60 minutes. It'll be him sitting on a bench, drinking a cup of coffee. Hang out at the coffee shop for four hours. That'll be at the coffee shop. Revisit the, revisit, sorry, resist the temptation for eight hours. That will be at Moe's. Fly his helicopter for 12 hours. So this is the task I was on about. I really want a task of Barney just flying around in his helicopter. So this will activate the helicopter and he'll be flying around in it. And then pour away his beer for 24 hours. That'll be his apartment. If you don't own his apartment for any reason, uh, it'll be at the Brown House. So that is my Barnier event. I hope you enjoyed. I actually think there is a lot of potential here. I think this event could work really well. Uh, I don't know. The way I've laid it out, I personally think it's amazing because I'm just great at making events. No, I'm joking. But um, yeah, I think this one could work. But anyway, stay tuned. For the next next week, as I'll be doing another one, I'll be putting a poll in Discord now for uh, what mini event you'd like to see. So we're gonna do uh, we're gonna do mini events, uh, and then the week after that, when we go back to major events, I am I swear to God, I'm not giving you a fourth choice now. You you have you have the choice between the film event, the hippie slash hipster event, or the other character spotlight event. You have three choices, and if you don't pick the hippie one, if you don't pick the hippie and hipster one, then you'll have two choices, and then. And then I'll make it one choice. You will, the hippie slash hipster event will win eventually. I'm telling you, it's been there for too long now. So you can either vote it, vote it out next, not next week, but the, well, yeah, next week. You can either vote out next week and uh, and and just be done with it, or you can just have no choices from now on because I'm fixing democracy. Goodbye. <laughs>